Hello and welcome to today's video. I really wanna show you a quick way that you can adjust your Instagram Reels as settings inside the app. So we all know what Instagram Reels are and if you don't, that's okay. We have the perfect video for you. You can find it right here. But if you are using Instagram Reels and you're wondering what your privacy settings are, I'd like to walk you really quickly through all of your options so that you know who's seeing your post and what control you have over your reach. So first things first, let's go into our Instagram Reels. We can get there on the bottom right hand side through the plus button up the top left hand side. If you don't have this post option, make sure you update your Instagram app. It is rolling out to everybody quite slowly. I'm going to press Instagram Reels down the bottom. So our Reels settings are not in our regular settings menu for Instagram. They are inside the Instagram Reels themselves. So let's go in there and you're gonna see my back camera. And here up the top left hand side is our settings wheel. So go ahead and click that before you post anything on Instagram Reels, just so that you're aware on who can see your content and what they can do with it. You'll see at the very top here, it says hide story from. I currently have zero people that I am hiding this story from, but you might have a very good reason to add a few names to this list. All you have to do is go on into that and select who you'd like to hide this from. It doesn't matter why, but they will not be able to see anything that you upload to Instagram Reels. Close friends is a list that you can add on Instagram, which means that maybe some of your content you only want to go out to a certain group of people. You can set that up right here. And then we move on to the next category, which is allowing message replies. So currently I have mindset on everyone. Anyone who sees my Instagram reel can feel free to reply to me, but maybe you'd like to be a bit more private than that. And you might want to have that set to people you follow. So only people I follow on this platform can send me a reply back so that I don't get message from strangers. Alternatively, you could just turn the whole thing off so that nobody can reply to your reel and you're just putting that content out for your own benefit. The next thing down is being able to save this item to your camera roll. So if this is toggled on, it means any Instagram reel or story that you make will be automatically saved to your phone camera gallery. So that is something to keep in mind if you'd like to keep a track of all of your things. I have mine switched off because of this second option here, which is save to archive. Instagram have their own archive inside the app and you can see everything you've ever posted to your Instagram reel before, even if it is no longer valid. So I have that switched on, uh, even if the 24 hours of a story has uh, ticked over, Instagram still keep a copy of that just for you in your own archive. And then we have the sharing options down the bottom, which is allowing other people to reshare my reel to their story. You may or may not want to do that. You might want complete control over your own content, in which case just switch that toggle off. Some people will send your Instagram reel to somebody else as a message. This second option here lets them do that or not. And then the final option here is whether or not you'd like your Instagram reel or story to be shared directly to a Facebook page that you have linked up with your Instagram account. So that's a personal preference there. Maybe if you're a brand or you have a product or something and you wanna cut down on your posting, you might want the same video to go across all of your platforms. Feel free to toggle that on or off. So they are just some of your story controls here. I just wanted to make sure you knew where those were so that you know exactly who's seeing your content and what they can do with it on Instagram Reels. 